Have you ever kept a collection of things in a scrapbook, on a bulletin board, or even on the door of your fridge? Pinterest.com is like the online version of that. Want to learn about what Pinterest is and how it works? You've come to the right place. I'm Jessica from techboomers.com. In this video, I'll tell you about what exactly Pinterest is and show you how it works. So let's get started. So what exactly is Pinterest? Pinterest is a website that helps you find and organize pictures, ideas, and interesting things through a series of user-created categories of boards and a series of bookmarks that they call pins. Pinterest pins can include photos, videos, drawings, animations, internet links, and more. There are tons of different topics of boards on Pinterest, so you're sure to find something that interests you. So why should you use Pinterest? There are lots of reasons people like to use Pinterest. You can use it to show off things you like, to find inspiration for art or decorating, to find new recipes to try, or to discover travel destinations. Some people use Pinterest to find things to make them laugh, and businesses can even use Pinterest to advertise and promote themselves to potential customers. So how does Pinterest work? I'll tell you about the four steps to using Pinterest. First, you'll want to sign up for an account. It's fast, easy, and free. Check out our How to Sign Up for Pinterest tutorial if you need some guidance. Step two is to create your own custom boards. You can create one for any category of pins you'd like to keep and organize. For example, you could have a board for recipes, one for outfit ideas, and one for home decor inspiration. Step three is to add pins to the boards you've created. You can pin things that other users have already added to Pinterest, or create new pins of your own using files from your computer. Lots of websites also have the built-in function to allow you to save things from their site to one of your Pinterest boards, so you can save them for later. The last step to using Pinterest is to connect with your friends and family by linking your Pinterest to your other social media accounts, like Facebook and Twitter. This will allow you to share pins with your friends and collaborate on boards together. So how safe is Pinterest? While most people use Pinterest honestly, there are some people who are not who they say they are on Pinterest. These people sometimes trick others into revealing personal information with fake giveaways or contests. Others may try to sabotage accounts by requesting to collaborate on boards. These scams are easy to avoid using critical thinking and common sense. Here are a few safety tips for using Pinterest. Number one, use common sense when looking at pins. If something seems too good to be true, it probably is. Number two, only collaborate on boards with people you know and trust. Number three, if you don't want people to see your content, then put it on a secret board or just don't post it at all. Number four, adjust your privacy settings to limit how much information is visible to others. If you need some guidance on how to do this, check out our Pinterest safety article. The link will be listed in the description box below this video. Overall, we'd give Pinterest a 9 out of 10. We love that it's free to use and super versatile. It's great for keeping your online life well organized. However, Pinterest isn't perfect. Like other social media sites, Pinterest has a few privacy issues, but you can avoid these problems with a bit of common sense. That aside, Pinterest is an awesome tool for finding and organizing interesting things so you can save them for later. It's easy to use and 100% free. If you'd like to learn more about Pinterest and how to use it, check out our free Pinterest course on techboomers.com. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd click the thumbs up button below. Check out techboomers.com for over 100 free courses on all of today's most popular websites and apps.